It could be called the Weinstein effect. The scandal surrounding the Hollywood film producer has shone a light on issues of rape and sexual harassment. As he continues to deny the allegations against him, Five News has evidence that the case is prompting a sharp rise in reports of rape here. The claims against Weinstein first surfaced on October the 6th, when the New York Times published its detailed allegations of sexual harassment. Rape Crisis England and Wales says it saw a 28% increase in calls the next week compared to the week before. The figure obtained by Five News is collated from its helplines based in 56 locations across England and Wales. Those running the national helpline say they haven't had this many calls for years. This is hugely significant. This is a huge 28% rise. Um, it's put a strain on our um, helpline, but it's also um, meant that a lot of people are trying to access us for therapy as well. Um, so I think around the country, all the rape crisis centres are seeing a huge increase in women and girls wanting to access services to help them. Children from as young as 13 have been calling in because it's on in the family home. Um, things have happened to them at school, and so they are also feeling empowered to do something about it. Normal, a normal hazard. Two weeks ago, in her first interview, Louise Godbold claimed Weinstein trapped her during a tour of his office in 1991. Today, the trauma counsellor told us she feels empowered to hear so many speaking out about sexual violence. I think it represents strength in numbers, that when you are the victim of an assault, it's very likely that you'll think you are the only one who got targeted. And so it's a relief to know that it wasn't you, it wasn't something you did, that there was a predator out there. And so there is that feeling of, OK, it's safe for now for me to come forward. As the claims against Weinstein grow in volume, so too does the wider conversation about harassment and assault. Julian Drucker, 5 News.